The 15th of March 2019 attacks were caused by racism and ignorance. They were attacks on all of humanity that broke hearts from every race and every religion. Two years ago, 51 innocent lives were taken without mercy at the hands of a coward. Their crime was their faith. Their crime was calling this beautiful city home. The pain of losing these 51 lives has not only impacted the people of Christchurch, it was a pain that rippled throughout New Zealand and the rest of the world. It is a miracle I am alive. I was shot nine times. Four bullets in my left, four bullets in my left leg, one in my right leg, three in my left arm, and another one in my mouth. The bullet in my mouth was stopped on its way to my brain only because of a dental breach. Harun smiling goodbye on the morning of Friday, 15th March, still echoes in my mind. Little did I know that the next time I would see him, the body and soul would not be together. Little did I know that the darkest day in New Zealand's history had dawned. That day, my heart broke into a thousand pieces, just like the hearts of the 50 other families. There will be an unquestionable legacy from March 15. Much of it will be heartbreaking, but it is never too early or too late for the legacy to be a more inclusive nation, one that stands proud of our diversity, embraces it, and if called to, defends it staunchly.